Hi lovies, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is wedding vlog. We are heading to um, Walgreens right now to print out our pictures for our save the date. So before that, if you're new to my channel, hello, welcome, my name is Jill. Here in my channel, I make motherhood and lifestyle videos. I do vlogs, cleaning, organizing, hauls. So if you like those kind of content, make sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you don't miss out. Check out my Facebook, Instagram, the girls' Instagram account, and TikTok account. I post updates, picture for, pictures of our family, and I just want to be connected with you guys. I post shop with me videos on my TikTok account. So if you're addicted like me to Target, check it out. So, yeah, it's a Sunday, and I'm going to go to Walgreens, Dollar Tree, and maybe Walmart to, um, you know, check some stuff. But, yeah, because we're going to do, like, save the dates today. So, I am back home. Went to Dollar Tree and Walgreens to pick up our pictures. I'm so in love with the pictures. Mm -hmm. Look, baby, is this you, babe? Oh, look at that face. Andrew and Jillian saved the date. And then our date. So in love. It's so, so pretty. I'm excited. So what I'm planning to do is to DIY my save the date. Yep, save the date like the magnet. So I got stuff from Amazon. Um, yeah, to do all this stuff right here. So <laughs> Andrew and the girls are playing. Here's what I got. We got um, um, envelope for you know to put our to put our invitations and save the date. Um, I think this is a hundred and it looks perfect. Looks perfect. The camera in the camera it looks like white, but it's like an off-white color. So we, we just need less than 50 for save the date and then less than 50 for the invitation. So we got that. And then we also got We also got the magnet. It's four by six. Uh, it's four by six self adhesive magnets. A hundred. So we just need like fifty, but you know we can use this in the future pictures of the girls and stuff like that. So I am excited to do this. Imagine this, and then right here. Yes. Fit just right. Um, I think so. You want to say hi? Hello. <laughs> no, but they even just want to do this. Yeah, yeah it looks like it. Too. Yeah. Yeah. Perfect. Yes. So yep, and then we got um, what do you call this? Paper A cutter. paper cutter. Paper cutter and then this um like um sticker. So what I'm planning to do with this, um uh, I'm gonna uh, do like the names and addresses of the guests here. I'm gonna use Canva and then print it right here and then just cut it. Because my handwriting is kinda like I'm a doctor. <laughs> Just kidding. And then I got, uh, we got, well, Andrew paid for it, so. Um, a ceiling glue wax in champagne color. And then, um, 
a wax seal stamp with our initial letter M. It's not focusing, but it's letter M. We got it from Amazon everything. I tried to like leave everything down below. So yeah, I am excited to like do this. Well, I'm preheating the oven for the girls to, um, you know, to eat lunch. I'm going to start doing this. Just at least, you know, um, sticking the, the pictures in the magnet. So we'll see. We'll see if this works. I got one. And then we're just going to peel this off. And then there's the picture. Here's the magnet. I just like peel like right here and then start sticking on the side. Very simple, save the date. And then you can just stick it on the fridge or whatever. And then you have your you know, DIY save the date. Let's try if we can stick it on our fridge. So here is it. It worked! I love it! But it worked, huh? It looks nice. It looks very good. Yeah, and it fits it perfect. Mm hmm So I just need to make, yeah, my kids, <laughs> she's in the bed. I just need to finish this and then I'll show you, you know, the process of doing the wax seal. I've never done it before, so this is the first time. Well, this is the first time I put like pictures in the magnet, so. And it looks really good. I'm obsessed. What do you think? Like, do you like it? It's very simple. I think the pictures are like 30, 37 cents in Walgreens. Very, um, very affordable. If you're gonna hire someone to do this, it's gonna be expensive. So, no thank you. So, I'm finished with all the, the pictures that I attach in the magnet. Um, yeah, the adhesive that you're gonna peel and then you're gonna stick the picture on, it's very sticky. So be careful on if you're gonna, you know, use the same DIY. Be careful because it's so sticky. I tried like, um, I think I messed up like three, but but it still like looks nice. I think. Yeah, um, yeah, I messed up three, but you know, it's, it still looks nice. So yeah, just you know, just be careful and stick in them. Yes. And then now, forty-five. Now, I'm just gonna put them in the envelope. 
So I'm just going to use like 45 and then the rest I'll be using on our invitation. I'm planning to, you know, DIY again my invitation. So I'm going to share it with you as well. So watch out for you know, my other wedding videos. I'll be sharing with you every detail that we're going to do in our wedding. I don't know. I just feel like, you know, it's good to look back when the kids are a little bit older. So here's our envelope. It's like off-white. Here's the back. So I'm just going to end... You know, you're just gonna peel this, then stick it, and then you're, you can put like your seal or something like that. That's what I'm planning to do, though. So yeah, I'm just I'm just gonna put everything in the envelope. So yeah, the envelope works perfect. Like that, and then seal. Put the address here, our return address, and the uh, stamp. So right now, I'm just heating my glue gun. Here's my wax um, stick. And then my wax stack right here. And here's my setup. I just put like parchment paper. Um, yeah, I saw like a trick that put this on like an ice, I think. And then so, you know, it's not going to stick and it will like dry quickly. I don't know, but I'll try to do that because I saw like they did good do with that. So I want to do the same thing. So here's my, all the save the dates. And I just need to Um, you know, what do you call this? Rip this and then stick them together. That's good that it comes with, you know, like that, that you can just peel off and then stick your, your invitation. So yeah, while waiting for my glue gun here. So for the eyes, I'm just gonna use my like an ice pack. I think it's just the same. So yeah, you know, um, wedding planning. Wedding planning is stressful and exciting at the same time it's stressful because you know that you need to budget everything and you still want to look nice um, and I'm not like um, I don't want to like spend a lot of money you know spending all our savings just for the wedding just for one day but you know, I still want to make it look nice, if that makes sense. So yeah, I'm just gonna like finish everything. So we're going to start um, doing the wax seal. 
So I have my um, <laughs> my stamp right here and the eyes. Here's my glue gun ready to go. So I'm just going to look. Oh yeah, it looks nice. It looks nice. I don't know if you can see, there's the letter M for our last name, my future last name, letter M. So I'm just going to do everything and then I'm going to show you the next step. So I'm done with um, putting all the stamps in the envelope. So now I'm working on the um, like the address so let's yeah I got this like sticker paper from Amazon I'm trying to like make this like print right here on this one so what I did on Canva I just put like um like U.S. document or something like that. U.S. letter 8 by 11. Eight, yeah, something like that. And then I put I put like a border right here in element. Um, tables. This one. And then I just put it right here. Like expand them. Um, I made like two columns. So... What I'm going to do is put like the names here. For example, my aunt right here, Mr. and Mrs. And then I'm going to do the same thing right here. Mr. and Mrs. as well. So, you know, if I print it out, it's going to come out like one piece right here. And then I'm just going to cut it with, with our paper cutter. So yeah, I'm gonna show you later if if it works or not. And we bought um like a personalized stamp from Etsy, like our names in our address. So we just need to like stamp, 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 stamp. So it's easier. So yeah. Too much work but I'm having fun so here's the um I don't want to show their address but yeah I just finished the um, the guest address and just I'm just gonna cut it So this one, the top one for the save the date, and then this one for the invitation. the next day and now I'm trying to um, put like 
call stage and um, you know the people's addresses I cut I just cut them and yeah I'm gonna stick it on the envelope we're still waiting for um, I don't know if you can see that we're still waiting for a personalized um, stamp return stamp and still not here I might print our address as a return return address because I need to I really need to send this save the dates <laughs> my kids are in the background wedding planning is exciting and stuff like that but like do it yourself stuff is kind of like stressful very stressful but if you want to save money go on that route and we're on the budget so we need to do it so I'm finally done I end up using <laughs> two of these stamp and plus five cents I went to um, post office yesterday just to you know double check if the postage is correct and good thing I didn't uh, mail without asking yeah they said I need 65 more so I think this is 60 60 and 5 so I was hoping to find like a 65 so I just like two stamps but they don't have 65 so I ended up using the rest of the stamp that I got and then plus five cents so on my invitation I'm just gonna buy a new set of stamp expensive just to say it to send the save the date I um, I think I paid like $55 for just for the stamp so ask your post office because if you have a waxy like this it's different story it's the it depends on the weight and stuff like that so ask your post office before you send your save the dates or your invitations because they're gonna they're gonna return everything if you didn't have the right stamp so yeah no tip so yeah I'll be going to the post office today to mail all these and then I'll update you later so I'm on my way to uh, the post office to drop off the mail got my mail right here I'm back home from the post office and Thank God I just sent my save the dates because it took a long time to like send it. But anyway, um, yeah, we're like six uh, six months out. Uh, we're July something. I don't know the date. Um, yeah, we're July and then January is the wedding. So we have six months to go before the wedding. And I need to do a lot of stuff. Um, yeah, I'm gonna start doing the the invitation. I'll be doing that as well. So more stress for me. Let's go. <laughs> but yeah, um, I just want to save like you know a lot of money. So watch out for my DIY invitation. It will be coming up soon. But yeah, that's pretty much it for today's video. I hope you like it. Give this a thumbs up if you do. Consider subscribing to my channel and hit that notification bell to be notified every time I post a video. If you have mommy video suggestions, leave it in the comments section to be featured on my comment of the day. Salamat at mahal ko kayo and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!